guys, this is Brain Spiral here, and today I'm going to show you how to animate in Blender in two minutes using Adobe Mixamo. Adobe Mixamo requires an Adobe account. Here's something. I tried creating one, but I realized I already made one back in 2018. Anyway, let's show you how it's done. First of all, here's an example of what Mixamo looks like. I'm going to do one with Penguin Luigi for an example. This is from the model's resource. You can use any model you like. You can use one from the model's resource. Like I said before, this is Penguin Luigi from Mario Kart Tour. I'm going to be importing my own model of Clam from Camp Laszlo. If you want to do this, click Upload Character. And this will show up. The required files are FBX and OBJ. And also they require zip folders for some reason. Ladies and gentlemen, here's Clam. On his beauty. This model is not rigged yet. So, we're going to be using the auto rigger that Mixamo comes with. First, you want to mark the chin. Well, this is going to be hard because Clam's chin is under his nose. First, then you want to do the wrists that are here. Oh, wait, they're here. And then the elbows, which are against the sleeves for some reason. And his knees, and then his groin. The groin. It won't take long for your character to become rigged. And here is the final result. Just look at this little thing. Look at around his surroundings. Here are a list of animations. I'm doing Thriller Part 3 on Clam and oh my god! Look at him go! Oh Clam's tail! And I also gotta love how uh, Clam just works right there. I won't really download this because my god, look at those smooth moves. And they perfectly got his chin and his nose isn't really moving. <laughs> you can search for animations up here. Here is the Macarena. It'll produce any second now. Come on. It'll take a moment to load. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, that took a good amount of time and there goes Clam doing the Macarena. I know his arms are clipping through his head, but that's okay, so you have to ignore that. If you're satisfied with your animation, hit download. You could choose some actions. File type, width skin, and keyframe reductions. I like to not touch anything and just hit download. It'll prepare for a moment. It'll download the asset and everything. And ladies and gentlemen, there it is. Your final step is to import it into Blender. The very moment you have Blender open, delete the default cube like we always do, and import the type of model you have. For my case, it's an FBX. Now your model is imported, but it's so small. That's no problem. Press the S key to scale it up. And here's Clam. Now hit play with the space bar. For my case, my computer is kind of trash. It's moving slowly, but your animation's imported. But may you may be asking, where are the textures? That's no problem. Import them yourself. The textures are imported. Oh, by the way, my clam model I just made 
as materials for his hat, so I'll be adding them. Once you've got your animations and materials up and ready, you're done! Also gotta love how Clam's tail moves. Anyway, that's gonna be it for this video. See you later!